On Saturday, President Yoweri Museveni, who is also the ruling NRM party chairman, was angry that some MPs had frustrated a number of investors by making unreasonable demands. He cited the Mabira Forest giveaway to the Meta Group to expand sugarcane production that was blocked by civil society activists and legislators in 2007. He asked the NRM Parliamentary Caucus to make a decision on the matter before the end of the retreat. Why should I even spend two days begging some characters that will put the factories to turn up our people, turn up the economy? Why? This is not acceptable. The president cited other industrial projects that he says were blocked or frustrated by what he described as economic saboteurs. He picked out Dairy Corporation and the proposed sugar factory by the Madvan Amuru district, northern Uganda. But now a group of legislators and civil society activists say the president used the wrong forum, the NRM caucus, to determine the country's destiny, yet cabinet and parliament are the constitutionally mandated bodies. They are now vowing to do whatever it takes to save Mavira Forest and other natural resources from unjustifiable degradation. We are therefore alerting the president and informing all Ugandans that we are committed to do everything legally possible to save Mavira Forest and other natural resources. Mavira does not belong to the NRM government. It belongs to the state of Uganda, and therefore it is held in public trust. We are not going to bank on sugarcane alone, but even our children have to survive, and our economy must survive, but not at the expense of exploiters. They accuse the president of resurrecting the Mabira debate to divert Ugandans from discussing prevailing major national concerns like huge corruption scandals, especially in the prime minister's office, and the cause of Mutali Jauman MP Nebanda's sudden death. That Mavira Forest giveaway will not be used as diversion from the current challenges the country is facing, such as poor governance or petroleum, land. Seven went for the, to the bush for a cause. The bush is no longer tenable today. There are alternative methods of getting one off the scene. The activists are vowing to mobilize Ugandans to shun sugar from factories that came up after the destruction of the ecosystem and land grabbing. They are also planning to petition donors to rein in President Museveni. We once did this and we are calling upon the public to shun buying, adding money that will be used to take away our forests and degrade our natural resources. The Opposition Forum for Democratic Change, FDC Party, also weighed into the fresh Mabira debate, saying forests should not be sacrificed at the altar of industries. As FDC, we are still strongly opposed to the giving yes. of Mabira for sugarcane growing. In 2007, anti-Mabira giveaway protests led to the death of at least five people in Kampala city center as activists clashed with riot police. Bushra Namirimo, Waswa Hassan, NBS Television, Parliament.